biotech is booming. To accommodate this growth, we need top-end infrastructure and support for startups. Therefore, VIB has invested in a new bio-incubator that provides knowledge, technology and space for young biotech startups. Located at the Tech Lane Science Park Campus Eiland in Ghent, the bio-incubator is based in one of Flanders' major cities and the capital of Flanders' biotech valley. In 2018, VIB launched a call for proposals for the design of an ultra-modern building that could house the next generation of pioneering startups in the life sciences. Modular architects, Stefan Bill architects and engineering firm Istema were finally trusted with the design. In October 2021, VIB began the construction of the new bio-incubator and headquarters. The foundations were laid, and every day we're getting closer to completion of a bio-incubator that will be a key component of the life sciences ecosystem in Flanders, Europe and beyond. Let us go for a quick tour of the building. On the ground floor, we find the reception, cafeteria, multifunctional meeting rooms, bicycle storage and all amenities needed to promote sustainable commutes. An outside terrace provides an ideal place for summer lunch breaks or outside meetings. The building's interactive screen shields everyone from the noise of the nearby motorway and, through walkways that connect the different floors, enables informal interactions between different units and startups housed in the incubator. There are 22 incubator units in total, which can be connected as well to allow startups to grow. Each unit has both office and top notch lab space. The VIB bio incubator fits perfectly within VIB's commitment to sustainability. The green campus, of which the VIB bio incubator will be the focal point, is built in the spirit of co-creation and sharing infrastructure. To reinforce its commitment, the building has the ambition to receive a BRIAM Excellence Certificate to illustrate its minimal environmental impact. This development is not only a new signboard for VIB, but for all its users and for the biotech ecosystem in Flanders.